Hey YouTube. Hey, I just got done building this. This is my bow target backstop. I've been shooting my bow out here at this uh, at this broadhead target down here, and every time I would miss a shot or or pull a shot, you know, you you end up where your arrow goes in the grass, and it's really hard to find, especially in this this tall grass down here at my shooting range. And um, so I decided to build me a backstop. And what I'm using for the backstop material, this is called a horse stall mat. It is a three quarter inch thick rubber mat um, made to put on the floor of horse stalls. And this thing basically is four by six feet. It weighs about a hundred pounds. And you can pick them up from anywhere from 20 to 35 bucks, depending if they're on sale. Um, bought this one for 35 I believe uh, so I, I got some used 4x4 four four posts and I had some lag bolts overall pretty cheap little project uh, me and the wife were out here shooting the other day and um, hit this mat quite a few times and um, and it uh, did great at stopping the arrows so let me go ahead and get my bow out and I'll go ahead and hit it a couple times just to show you um, how well this works. Now let's take a closer look. You'll see that the uh, top arrow, that is a muzzy with practice blades on it. So them are non uh, razor, they're non sharpened blades and it did not fully penetrate. And in the field point, that's what's on the bottom, just a regular field point, it did penetrate. So let's walk around and, and look at the back side. You're going to see there's the field point, and the shaft just came through about a half inch. And then there is the practice broadhead. Uh, didn't quite, barely made it through. So overall, the uh, backstop, target backstop, I think will work out just fine. Um, it's a low cost method. If you're wanting to look for something to stop arrows, this horse mat material looks like um, it's going to work out pretty good. Small Town 442 signing off. Thanks for watching.